everybody, Max Teacher Gaming here, and here we go. Been doing this video again. Two year anniversary of the Ark series. Holy crap. Oh, it makes me happy making something like this. See, talking about the Ark series last year, I mean, I won't, I won't have to address that same stuff again. I mean, not all of it at least, but, but um, uh, I thought maybe at some point the Ark series might die down, but any thoughts of that? I've been extinguished. For a small YouTuber of my level, the Ark series is still the leading content on my channel. Going strong. When I made the last video last October, uh, on the one year anniversary, we were talking about finishing the island, heading to the tech cave, finishing it, beating the final boss, and heading over to Scorched And look how much we've done since then. It's a short. It was a shorter series, but still a hell of a journey. Me, Finn, and Joe. Legends Finn and Joe for sticking with me for the Toe Arc series, so pr props to the two of them, they're both legends. But, um, yeah, we so he we went to Scorched Earth after beating an Overseer in an epic boss fight, and a fantastic cutscene after that. We went to Scorched Earth, and we beat the entire map, we, you know, we beat all three caves, got all three artifacts, got ourselves some mighty wyverns for death worms and all kinds of stuff, what happened after that? We fought a freaking Alpha Manticore, like, there was me thinking... Just gonna, you know, we're gonna fight normal Manticore. I mean, granted, we failed the first attempt, but Joe's battery ran, batteries ran out and we were a man down. But, hell, it, it was such a fun boss fight because you can bring flies. It was nice to have something different to just fill on Rexes all over the place. I wanted to do something different. But I knew that most people who do that boss fight go nuts with the Wivens and just bring all non stop Wivens and crowd their teleporting platform. But we thought it'd be more fun to breed a bunch of Argentavis get a hell of a cool bird army then bring one wyvern which was smaug and uh and yeah and then like, a couple rexes and one UT. and man it, it wasn't the best technique but it won so yeah i admit we could have done damage a lot quicker with other stuff but where's the fun in doing the same stuff over and over it's more fun to be different uh so yeah so we beat scorched earth that was a hell of a good series and now we're on aberration and things are getting really excited because i'm loving aberration so far it's so much fun all the creatures are so unique, there's so many creatures. I mean, yes, Scorched Earth had unique creatures, but Aberration is a whole new level. It's so much fun. So I'm really glad you guys are enjoying the Aberration series, and of course with me starting my own separate modded series, uh, when I say that is the modded maps, of course I've started on the center now. So I will point out that the center series is um, basically, well, if, if any of you I haven't got the full gist of it yet. It's a completely separate series. I'm using a different character as opposed to my character I've used from like, the island, Scorched Earth, and now on Aberration. And this journey on the modded maps, it'll be on the center. Then we beat the Broodmother and the Megapithecus together. Go to Ragnarok. Beat the Manticore and the Dragon together. Then go to Valguero. And I think it's all three of them. I think. In the Valguero one. But I just wanted to, you know, I wanted to, because we can't always record Aberration, you know, either Joe's not around, Finn's not around, or I'm not around, or something like that. It's awkward finding time to record these videos, guys. Um, that's why so sometimes there's massive gaps. So I want, but I love Ark so much, so when the guys aren't around, and I am, that's why this I invented this series, so I can still enjoy Ark when I can't record with the guys. And it's so far, I'm loving it, and I'm sure you guys are too. But um, So it's going to be mainly a solo series. I'm going to be dealing with the modern maps myself, but as I mentioned before, we'll have special guests popping up every now and then. Possibly Joe, possibly Leo, possibly Finn. So there's something. So they will have special guests pop up. I'm not going to say when. I'll let you guys wait and look forward to that. But it's mainly going to be focused on a solo journey with me. And I'm enjoying it so far. It's great. I want to appreciate these modern maps because they're great, they're free, and I might as well play them alongside the main maps. So right now it's, uh, it's Aberration alongside the center, and obviously eventually we'll beat Aberration, go to Extinction, and I'll beat the center and go to Ragnarok. So it's all it's all a lot of fun. I just love it so much. It's so rewarding. But going back to all that crap I was talking about with my horror series not doing well, I stand by what I said. I still upload my horror videos now. I'm finishing Evil Within and Resident Evil 7, and then I'm going to take a break from horror for a bit. Um, but when I upload horror videos and then compare them to Ark videos I've uploaded, there's just no comparison. The Ark is the Ark series is killing it for someone of my level, and I'm loving it. It's great. Um, but I've got some exciting in store for when I finish um, the horror series. But focusing on Ark now, this is a, this is the celebration of the Ark series. So w two years ago today, me, Finn, and Joe all started on the island, and who would have thought the whole series would have 
you know, two years in the two years later on, done really well for a small YouTuber like me, and I love it. It's really, really good. It's just so much fun. I just love going through all the different experiences and ex exploring this thing because this game is it's a it's such a good game. And sometimes it's underrated. People always give it crap, but that's because playing it by yourself is really not always the best thing to do if you're not confident by yourself. I mean, by me, by I mean, yeah, I'm playing by myself on the modded maps, but I've played this game for ages, and if you're someone who prefers to have a little bit of backup, then this game is the best thing to play with at least one other person. Because it can get really difficult when you're playing solo. You know, if you die, you die. There's no one to, you know, tell you where your stuff is, <laughs> things like that. But I honestly am really enjoying it. I just wanted to say thanks for all the people, all the loyal people who are just subscribed for the ARC stuff. And I really hope you guys are enjoying the ARC videos. And, uh, see, I thought this video would be longer, but I think I pretty much addressed it. It's not just going to be like the other anniversary video, because that one I had more stuff to point out. But this is the same thing, so, yeah, so, I mean, I can I can tell you that in the next, ab so, in the next Aberration video, uh, wait, what, was, what, what, what have we done? I just done, oh, yes, we've just tamed a roll rat, a megalosaurus, and a bear, which is nice, because we never had, never had a bear before, or a Megalosaurus. So, all bunch of unique tens that we all, all love. I'm loving the Megalosaurus. I've been leveling... I called her Aurora, and I've been leveling her up off... off I mean, off camera. Because, at night time, they get a massive buff. And it is so fun. I'm just going around slaying things. Um, so, yeah, in the next Aberration video, as you guys saw in the video I've uploaded, we found the first cave in our old base. So, in the next Aberration video, we're going to be going in that cave and retrieving the Artifact of the Depths, as I now know it's called. We have, I've already recorded it, but I won't say anything else. But, yeah, it was a pretty crazy cave. Pretty crazy. A lot more manic than the caves of Scorched Earth. Only only a bit, but I'm, I'm worried about the, what the rest of rest of the Aberration caves have to offer. Um, so, yeah, so look forward to the cave video. Then, after that cave video, we're probably going to do some exploring in the Blue Zone, where our, where our main base is set up at the moment, because we still don't know much about the area. We want to go exploring uh and then obviously center wise you've just seen a video of me taming a rex solo with a crossbow which i didn't think would work out uh but it did um so in the next video i am moving over to a new base which i've set up i've already recorded that as well but i just haven't got around to uploading it besides i've already uploaded some stuff anyway um but yes yeah, so i take the rex uh what well, zero i called the rex i take the rex and my little dillos and the parasaurs over to a new base. It's a pretty scary episode because I had to cross a whole... I, I, I had to cross a, a little bit of sea stretch. And there was a bunch of sharks and mantas. It was pretty chaotic. So I look forward to that. That's the next centre episode. But yeah, I think that's pretty much the main stuff to address. I just wanted to put this little video up. Just a little thing. He just celebrating two years of arc. Credit goes to my good friend Will. Uh, you know, from the Human Full Fat series and other things like that. Speedrunners. Will uh, made the thumbnail of this video you're watching now. He's much better at Photoshop than I am. But, um, yeah, so, yeah, happy birthday for the two years anniversary of the ARC series, all that rubbish, but I am loving the ARC series so far, and I cannot wait to see what this the future has to hold. I'm going to be playing ARC on my channel for so much longer. I, I was worried the minute we finished Extinction, the series will be all over, but obviously I, my genius came up with this idea of the modded maps, so I've got plenty of those to play, and now with ARC Genesis coming out after Extinction, oh, I've already pre-ordered it, I'm so excited for everything. Oh, man. Okay, guys, so thanks so much for su supporting the ARC series, those of you subscribed to my channel. And uh, here's to all the ARC videos in the future. And here's to Finn and Joe for being real legends and sticking with me for this long. <laughs> Alright, guys, thanks for watching this video. Like, subscribe, and if you haven't, go check out my ARC videos. Because for a small YouTuber like me, you won't be disappointed. Alright, thanks a lot for watching this video, guys. Take care of yourselves. See you in the next video. Goodbye.